Be prepared for highly offensive language from the start, adult themes and sexual references. Previously, Big Brother's annihilation caused chaos. The annihilation begins here. Sorry, Chelsea. Chelsea. Chelsea, you have lost your place in the Big Brother house. You must pick one housemate to evict from the Big Brother house. Let's take shot. No! Up next. You just don't know who to trust. Oh my god. It's so wrong. It is kill or be killed. Tonight, the final annihilation. Your fate now lies in the hands of your fellow housemates. Ryan. 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 I do not like the derogatory way they talk about men and women. Derogatory way. And the house is left in shock. That is game playing if it ever was one. Jason, you're a dickhead. He's a two-faced prick. I don't want us to talk to no one. Now I'm questioning myself again. Why are you having a go at me? Well, how do you think I feel, Sam? Just leave it while I'm not arsed at all. Twats. Dear 39, 9.41 a.m. I won't just survive Oh, you will see me thrive All week, annihilation has rocked the house. We're all fight up for eviction and it's annihilation. It's the worst we can do today. Later tonight, all housemates apart from Andy will face the final annihilation. Sam is talking to Big Brother. Everyone's very anxious and nervous about what's going to happen either today or tonight. Um, we're actually bringing things up from the past that have happened. It's been a tough week. And there's a lot of stress and anxiety and worry that comes with it as well. It's not, it's not easy. You know, you're waking up every day thinking, oh, it could be your last day. Laura, Evelyn, Jane and Huey are talking about playing the game. You can't, you can't play tactics here. I don't think you can. Oh, you can't. I, I think there's tactics being oh, played. I do. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I, do. I, I do. do. I do. Yeah, I do. Like, do you? The Tisha's eviction was purely tactical, even yeah, though I'm not going to win. So tactical. Yeah. Purely tactical. But, 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 yeah. but you I say think. that, but I don't say... It was tactical, but it was the right choice for Jason. We oh. all had to make that oh. choice. For example, say, for example, you press that. I won't ask you who you would have chosen, but if you'd chosen somebody, that mm. would have been because you would have chosen him. You wouldn't have chosen him for, or her for me. No, you would have chosen yeah. So is that tactical? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. But for Jason, making that choice, yeah, yeah, yeah. I agreed. Ten sixteen AM. Gian has a question for Jackson. What does piffed mean? Piff means good. Piff means good. Piff. And sick means great. Because yeah. in my day, sick means you're in bed with a headache. Bad means good. Bad means good. Bad. <laughs> you're a bad girl, dear. Because you learn a whole different language in here. And fat means good as well. Fat means... Yeah. So if I said, oh, that's fat... <laughs> yeah. No one says that anymore, <laughs> <laughs> no one says it anymore, but still, yeah. if you said it, people would know what you're saying. Like, I like you said it to me, and then we know what you're saying. Yeah. <laughs> so, if you were talking to a rather large person, would they get the ump with that? Well, it would be like, you're fat talk. with a pH. Yeah, you're fat. Oh, with you're pH. fat. Fat. Yeah. Mm. Ryan has morning breath. My breath stinks garlic. So does mine. Let me smell. No. <laughs> <TV>. <laughs> Don't do that. Is the smell of garlic? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> uh. Uh. Please don't get sick. I'm begging of you. Uh. What have you eaten? Ten fucking garlic clovers. What do Dracula's eat? I think it's blood. Well, who who eats garlic? Um. Oh, I can't even be round you. Who does eat garlic? 
Oh. I can't remember. No, me neither. Maybe it's Spanish people. Or French. I can't really remember. Ooh. <sighs> Go and get some deodorant and spray it in your mouth. Eleven twenty-five a.m. Laura is feeling unwell. I feel really sick today, but I think it's I think it's nerves, you know. All I know is something's about to go down today. Yeah, I think um And it's it's been way too calm for two days, like yeah. it's it's definitely nerves. I mean they've given us the prize money. That was a bang. It's been silent for two days. Yeah. Shit's about to go down. Jackson has got a new haircut. You 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 couldn't look any more like that if you tried. Well, I now look like that even more. Even more like that right now. Do you not like it, Jane? Yeah, no, it's cool. You're young. It, yeah, it's cool. Yeah. <laughs> it's different. Yeah. Got to win it. Got to change it up. Yeah. Yeah, it's different. It's different. Makes me laugh, like older men would give you their eye teeth to have hair like young men like him. And he goes off and shaves it all. Life's bizarre. Jason's talking to Andy about Ryan. I don't know if I should say anything or not. I don't know if it's the right... Just word it how you want to I mean, I would not talk derogatory. I've been brought up and I would not talk derogatory about a man or a woman, regardless of sexuality. Mm -hmm. And... If someone turns around in front of a group of people and goes, go on, Cannon, fuck her up the arse. Right. I don't think that's right. Emily, get yourself under that duvet and have a good night's kick, you little, you little mucky sausage. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mucky sausage? Get yourself under there and get pummeled by a good old Cannon. <laughs> Cannon's gonna cannon you up the arse. You've got a cannonball her. Cannonball. <laughs> It's extreme. At the best, it's very, very, it's very, very crude. I wouldn't go to a girl. I'd fuck you, and I'd fuck you, and I'd fuck you. Mm. Yeah. Sitting there grinding on someone's face and performing sex acts in front of people yeah. is wrong. I wouldn't do it in public. I wouldn't do it. He had a group. He had a group of people in his house, some of whom have now gone. Who. Um, who all found that very funny, and the more extreme, and the more outlandish, and the more offensive your language and your behaviour was, the more they would laugh, the more hilarious they found it. And it's, it's egged on Ryan, particularly, to be more and more like that. But that's disrespectful. It makes people feel awkward. Yeah. But it's crass, isn't it? Twelve or seven p.m. Andy is in the diary room talking to Big Brother. When the evictions happen, it's the outside world coming in, and you can hear people shouting things, and you can hear people chanting things, and cheering things, and booing things. And I'd be lying if I said that that didn't kind of play on my mind a little bit. I've never had a big cheer uh, from the crowd in this house, and. Um, I guess I just worry every week about, you know, it, it's, a, it's a moment when you do ponder how you're being seen on the outside. Most of the housemates are talking about tattoos. Gonna get, I was going to get Cheryl Cole forever, my love. <laughs> <laughs> no, I did used to like it, but I would never have dreamt to get Cheryl Cole forever, my love. Yes, you would, <laughs> He do that for an extra few Facebook likes. <laughs> Just to get me out here, it's another way of doing it. You're gonna get Ryan tattooed no. on you. No, just not? a hand bomb. Ryan? Why would you not get my name? Shut up, I'll you. get your name. No, Ryan tattooed Go on, on and get you, it done first. On you, um, on you You've now. got fucking D Emily on your arse, and it doesn't. Oh, shut the fuck up! And it was meant to say Emily, but they put D apostrophe Emily. 
your mom and Stan. Emily. I was drunk and Magaluffin was 18. I don't want to go into a chain. Tell them to start off. So why did they put the D in it? Let's see, is Did you tell them off? What? Did you shout at him when they found I'm not saying anything. Stop it. I've spoke with all these things too much. My mum doesn't even know I have that. Demily. And you won't get my name tattooed no. on you. But you've got, got Demily on your well, you'll ass. But you'll get Demily and it weren't even the right name. That's fucking out of order. It just shows Bang how much you order. care about me. Oh. Who is Emily? Normally you won't shut I'm not, up. It's just a tattoo. Have so you got a girlfriend on the outside world called yeah. Emily? Yeah. Is this something you're not telling me? I've, I've lied my way through all of this competition. <laughs> <laughs> so what, who's, who's D. Emily? Oh, it, it wasn't... The man was Spanish. He obviously didn't understand, but I'm not going to talk about it anymore. Stop talking about that. So it was a Spanish girl. So imagine, Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> imagine I, I think him. he doesn't want to talk imagine about it anymore. Jesus Christ, what part of that It's, all, it's a funny story what you got the Magalor. Shut the fuck up. Don't get your arse out to everybody and show You've your tattoo and not expect... Don't get your arse out and not expect people to ask about it. Chill out. Is it a serious topic? We'll come off it if it's a serious topic. Must stop it. You want to? He's still looking at me. Oh, bore off! Coming up, Ryan's eviction prediction. I'm gonna go and get evicted in a bin bag. I'm wearing a bin bag and I'm gonna get evicted. <laughs> Be prepared for offensive language. <laughs> 3 31 pm. Ryan is given Huey a fearful. Open your mouth. Uh, honestly. Uh, well, uh, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> is it edible? Is it edible? Because some things else are edible. <laughs> oh, how cold. What is wrong with him? Why can't he fucking ever do anything right? Jackson is confiding in Andy. I came on a reality show to escape the harsh realities of the outside. And now I'm... It's the only thing I fear about as well now. Is actually going out there. All of this will seem so inconsequential when you're out, though. I'm actually a little bit scared of the thought of leaving here now. What is it you're scared of? I feel safe. Mm. I feel routine. That's what I am the word I'm looking for. I like the routine. Yeah, it's the simplicity, isn't it? Have I become institutionalised, Andy? Huey has come to the pod to let his fierce mask dry off. What are you doing? I'm meditating. Why are you leaving me? Because I'm at my salon. Oh, no, but don't leave me. I'm in, I'm in the middle of having a treatment. Oh. What are you thinking of? It's loads of shit. What? Imagine the two of us went together tonight. I could see that happening. I could see people doing that. Well, don't, well, don't, well, don't oh, say I'm not it. going to be talking in here. I'm not going to say anything. Because no one is safe. I think the only person who's safe is Sam. Mm. And he deserves it, to be fair. Yeah, but so do we. Seven twenty-one p.m. Jesus Christ. Laura is getting ready for tonight's eviction. I'm so nervous. <gasps> oh, my God, I'm going to have a full-blown panic attack. <sighs> Fucking hell. <gasps> Sam, I'm, I I, 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 I'm shitting myself. Mm. I'm shitting myself. You are right? I'm just so nervous. I'm so utterly... Oh, shit! <laughs> Please, Laura, come on. You've got to dip. I've got to be able to snap out of this. I, I, I can't. Yeah. I get so nervous. That's understandable. 
Ryan has come to the diary room. When me and Letitia was in the house, we agreed that we'd leave in bin bags if we had a normal eviction uh, and not through, like, a diary room. So, obviously, Tisha didn't get a normal eviction, so she didn't wear a bin bag, but I'm sticking to my word and going to wear a bin bag if I get evicted. Um, I know I look like a piece of shit, but I'm, I want to wear the bin bag. It's up to housemates to decide what they would like to wear for eviction. So I can wear the bin bag? I'm gonna go and get evicted in a bin bag. I'm wearing a bin bag and I'm gonna get evicted. I feel like, oh my God, I actually feel like Lady Gaga. Um, did you like that? Big Brother did. Yes, May. Ryan, if there's nothing else, then the diary room door's now open. Oh, my God, this might be the last time that I ever speak to you, Big Brother. So... Goodbye. Andy and Jason are speculating about tonight's annihilation. I oh, just don't want another roasting. You mean from a fellow housemate? Yeah. It, it'd just be a shame to go into the final week with if it is the final week, mm -hmm. to go into that with people that <laughs> try to get you out instead of, you know, that bad, instead of... Oh, well, Jason, I think <coughs> that's likely to happen. If not for you, it'll happen for people. I mean, that's just what... That's just what's going to happen. And then everyone will go, oh, I didn't mean that, I meant this. And, oh, no, you know I love you and you know I really respect you. And I just had to make a choice and I didn't know who to pick and I love everyone in the house and it's such a difficult decision. And then everyone will carry on. Yeah. We've heard it a hundred times, haven't we? I oh, know. If it goes to decisions in the house, it's going to be the person that's got more friends. It's going to be the person that survives, um, which makes it a popularity contest on the inside. But it is a popularity contest on the outside, isn't it? Yeah, but if you think about who is now in this house after Teach leaving, for instance, if it's a popularity contest, you're not actually doing that badly, are you? If there's a popular group in the house, it's you, Jacko, Alex, and to Dude. a certain extent, me, and then other people who fit into it from time to time. Still a minority. Ten or three p.m., Big Brother has gathered the housemates. Big Brother house, this is Emma. Wag, wag. This is no ordinary eviction. Oh, oh there we go. Oh, oh no! What? what is that? Hold on. Oh, I can't cope with this. Oh, what is it? Oh, 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 Housemates, make your way to the garden oh, and stand. Oh, stand behind the podium with your name on. Oh, oh my god. I haven't got oh, no, to meet her yet. Oh That's my god. Hello. Hello. Following the public vote, all housemates apart from Laura, Ryan, and Sam are now safe from annihilation. Your fate now lies in the hands of your fellow housemates. Great. Oh. Only they have the power to evict one of you. Oh. Laura, Ryan, and Sam. You will each have 10 seconds to explain why that shouldn't be you. Laura, you go first. Oh, why great. shouldn't you be evicted? Um, I shouldn't be evicted because... Stop booing! Um, I'm having an amazing time. I've had yeah. such an amazing... Well, actually, not an amazing journey so far. So I want to be Time's in the up. final week. Great. Ryan, you're next. Your time starts now. Um, I think I should be in the house because I'm funny, I'm real, I'm where it's at, and I'm where the fucking party's at. Don't let the party end just yet. <laughs> OK, so I've made uh, some amazing friends in the house. I absolutely love every single one of you to bits, and I really hope you will keep me in. Oh, fucking hell. Oh, I can't do it. Uh, OK, so safe house, mates. It is decision time. In front of you is an envelope containing three cards numbered one, two, and three. If you want to evict Laura, select number one. If you want to evict Ryan, it's number two. And if you want to evict Sam, pick number three. I can't oh do it. Oh, my God, I can't cope with this. You'll get saved, and if I go, do it for Blackpool, mate. 
You ain't going anywhere, are you? I can't oh, bear shit. to do. Housemates. Laura, just breathe. Alex, you will go first. Please reveal your card and give the name of the person you want to evict tonight and your reason. Laura, sorry babe. Um, just because I'm not as close to you as I am everyone else in the house. I've never really sat down and had just a one-to-one -one chat with you and I have with everyone else. It's not your fault or mine, really. It's just the way the cookie crumbles, I suppose. Okay, sorry, you. babe. Ryan. Of the three people there, uh, I've made good friends with Sam recently. I've been good friends with Laura for a few weeks. Ryan, we're just getting to know each other now. Yeah. But of course, we have a bit of a history. You called me a snake and various other things, and I've not yet forgotten that. Oh. I love you, Zor. Sorry, Ryan. Oh, listen, on. listen, I love you to bits, but I feel like throughout the Big Brother experience, you haven't really sat me down and you haven't bothered to like really get to know me as much I speak as to you all the time. And Emily. Sam, as compared to Laura and Sam, I'm all right. talking. That's fine, no problem. Huey, brain. who do you wish to evict and why? <sighs> Laura, I, I absolutely love you and I, I really, really want to be friends with you and we're really close. I could not pick Sam. I couldn't justify picking him. And Ryan, I think this brings more to this than you do. You've come so far and I'm so proud of you. And Thank we you. will be friends, but I, I, out of the tree, I just couldn't Don't choose worry, anyone else. I'm it's sorry. Thanks, Huey. Jackson, your turn. Who are you evicting and why? Only because it's the three that's up there, and you, it's such a shame because over the past week we've really got to know each other. But just because of the other two, I've had to go with our Laura. I'm so looking forward to going out there. It's great. Um, the person I'm evicting is because the selfish acts they've done in the past, but mainly I do not like the derogatory way they talk about men and women in the house. Ryan. Derogatory way? Yeah. What do you mean? Well, I'm not explaining it here and now. I'll well, do it You've never had an issue with me before and said it, so why have I'm you not said it beforehand? And finally, Jane, which housemate would you like to evict and why? I um, get on with all three. However, I'm purely going on the basis of, of who entered the poor garden. So, sorry, Ryan. <laughs> Thank you. Jane, you have chosen to evict Ryan. Oh, Laura, Ryan and Sam, the housemates have spoken. And Ryan, with four votes, you are leaving the house Sorry, this Ryan. evening. Annihilation week no, no. has come no, to no, an no, end. Say out. your goodbyes. You're the best housemate. I'll ever see you outside. Show. You're amazing. Do you understand that? Thank you, thank you. And that is game playing if there ever was one. You're okay. absolutely incredible. That's what you are. Ryan, I have right, to go on the poor garden. It's all right, Jay. I love you. Right. Jason, you are a disgrace. Oh, that is that's that's exactly what you are. Yeah, you have something that? to say, you should start saying it to people. When the, how does it be derogatory towards what? men and women? Go, go on, can and fuck Ethan oh, up the arse. When, when did he say that? They're just letting him have his last Do you want me to carry on? I don't recall any of that. Please leave. I love you all. Oh, I love you, Ryan. Ryan, you're a star. Sam, do this fucking thing. And if you mate. don't, come on. If you don't fucking win. Ryan! 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 I love you, Ryan! 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 Smash it! We love you, Ryan! Bye! Come on, Ryan! 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 Cut!
coming up, Huey's had it with Jason. I and shake hands with you, but I, I, I don't want us to talk for no one, but I'll shake hands with you. Yeah. It's yeah, fine. You. Because I don't agree with your principles and how you do things, but it's over, don't we? Be prepared for highly offensive language, adult themes, and sexual references. <laughs> Ten twenty p.m. It's been ten minutes since Ryan became the seventh housemate to be evicted from the Big Brother house. Huey, Huey, I'll explain myself later to you when we've got when things all calm down. All right? I am calm. It's fine. Yeah, well, we all have now. to make a decision, but I don't understand why you wait till moments like this to say anything. I don't think Ryan is derogatory towards have... anyone. I I got on well with Laura. I had to take a decision for her. I get that. But I don't understand where the derogatory part comes in. I don't see that. Anyone, anyone to me, anyone to me, yeah. I'll tell you, I'll tell you now very quickly. Right. Yeah. Ignore the selfish acts. Right. We'll, get, we'll forget that. We'll move on from that later. Anyone to me that goes, Canon, go and fuck her up the arse. If I went to it about a woman, yeah, and I start saying, I'll, I'll fuck her and I'll fuck her, regardless if it's male or female, I'll be called an animal. Right, if it was me, because of my size and my height. When, when someone says, I'll fuck you up the arse, I'll bum this, I'll bum that, I it's wrong. I've never heard him saying anything like that before. He said I it. Didn't, I've never once right. heard him saying that. OK, right, so do you understand? We, we have a joke with Alex, and that's I don't the care, other I don't, care, I don't care if it's a joke. Are, are we offending you if we all have no, a joke? No, it's just opinion, me. isn't it? All, I've got friends in every walks of life, and if anyone talked like that, they wouldn't be my friends. They wouldn't be like that. Okay. And I'm sorry, but I just find it wrong. And I did, you know, I wasn't going into massive detail there, there and then. But it's derogatory to it's derogatory to men, and it's derogatory, derogatory to women. And I just don't like that. I wouldn't talk about people like that. And I, and that's and that was my reasons. Okay. All right. I'm, uh, Huey, look, here's my hand. I'm, I'm sorry, I, I understand the situation. Jay, but I, I, I don't want us to talk for no one, but I'll shake hands with you. If you don't talk to me, that's up to you. Because I don't agree with your principles and how you do things, but it's over, do not it? There's so many things I'm getting frustrated. How does she doesn't deserve that? After the things she's put herself through in here, she doesn't deserve no, that on the outside. That's decides the votes. You really don't, Laura? I, 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 it's honestly, really annoying. I, I, You've done more in here than else. anyone else and done it so well. I don't know what else I can do for people to... I, I'm, I'm so Fuck scared them, to leave Laura. this house. Fuck them. I'm it's so fine. scared. It's nothing. It's just a few I don't, people. You don't deserve it. I mean, I don't think it's fair what Huey said. Huey, what? Huey, what did you say about why was your reason for me? Yeah. Because he he does, he does, what did no, he say? No, I, I was I, I couldn't think of a reason whatsoever for Sam. I just want to know, like, I what? It's fine. It's absolutely fine. Everybody had to choose one person. But actually, I didn't ever think it would be you that would do. I did. I just was quite shocked when. Yeah, I know that. But if Sam or Ryan because you said there, Sam hasn't done anything. To, to no, you haven't done anything to me either. But yeah, I couldn't justify any type of a thing. I know. I do really you know what? Couldn't. I'm not. It's fine. Uh, but I absolutely love you. I talk to you more than I talk to him. I know. That's what I thought. I get that. I do. I but actually thought. Trust me, there's a lot of others I pick over you than if they were up there. So don't worry about that. I won't. It's 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 just awful. It's You're in my top awful. few people. Like Sam, I know you were boo, but fuck me. Was like everybody wants me out of the house. Was I booed a lot? No. Yeah. No. Was you were, but so were all no. three was of us. Alex said you you I, Alex said there was only a couple. Well, what did you hear, Sam? I, I don't know, if it was a big word to me. It, you had booze and cheers. Yeah. You had booze and cheers. But you just said I had a lot. No, yeah, you got a, you got a, we all got a lot. You did get a lot, but then you got lots oh, of right. cheers. Alex is different, but... You right. didn't get a lot of cheers in the first Sam, round. Sam, come here. No, I'm just no, trying, no, it's fine. Sam. I'm, I'm fine. I'm, I'm honestly, I'm fine. fine. People take things... Do you know I'm what's I'm absolutely fine. fine. I'm just, I've been absolutely I'm, I'm, chanted I'm, out of this house, Sam. Why are you having a go at me? Because I said that you had a lot of booze, you had a lot I'm of cheers saying, as well. I, 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 I don't want to hear anything, so I'm wondering what happened. Yeah, but you don't just like... Just leave me, I'm fine. Fuck me. Right. These are the doors need to open because we need Just because he said he had a lot of booze, he did have a lot of 
booze. You had a lot of cheers as well. We all I had a lot said, of booze. I just said, oh, did booze. I have a lot? She went, yeah. When I was like, oh, Alex, well, what did you have to couple. say? Do you know what? Oh it's how people Get fucking handle things in here. He's had a few fucking booze. Oh what do, well, how do you think I feel, Sam? What are you on about? How do you think I feel? Why are you shouting at me? Because it's annoying how you I'm just you're trying to it... get away from the situation. Leave me alone. I'm okay. walking away because you're obviously irate. So I'm you asked so I'm me if you got to... booze, Sam. What? You asked me if you got a lot of booze. I know. And, and I you said, said yes. yeah. I mean, I said, oh, Alex said he only had a few. I, I, I was, that's all I said. And you went, no, you had a lot. I was like, oh, right, no, okay. No, I said you had you a lot what, of booze. Do you know what I'm coming from? I was a bit like, oh, a bit took back by your answer. That's all. I know, but you were, you right. were, you were pissed off with like, me. Oh, why not just leave it, Laura? I'm not arsed. Shut up. Fuck me. Oh. 10.41 p.m. Sam has something to say to Laura. I'm really, really not coping very well with what just happened. I know. I know we've, I've saved, I've been saved. I know. Stuff, but I just... It's, it's, her, it's horrendous. I need to go for a fight. I need to chill out of this whole situation. I should, I should have just known that. No, I should have just known that. I'm kind of just used to it. I, so for yeah. me, it's just like, oh, great. I understand, like, you, fucking hell, you're, you feel 100 times worse after what just happened to you. Yeah. yeah. I understand that. I'm sorry for snapping just then. And I'm really sorry as well. I know. Sorry you know what? Well. I'm so sensitive, aren't I? You I know. know. I, I honestly cannot believe that one, you weren't. I, 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 to me, I cannot fathom that at all. With me, it pisses me off because I just think. Fucking hell, can you not forget what's happened in the first week? Mm. But for you, I am really shocked at that, and it should not have happened at all, but just forget about it. Yeah. Just forget it. Okay. Jason and Andy are chatting about the eviction. You weren't in the bottom three. People are voting for you out there. Yeah, I know that. I understand that. Yeah, I understand that. So try and focus on that more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I right. know it's impossible, but... No, I, I'm, I'm all right about that, really. Yeah, I, I'm a little bit sad that Ryan personally took... It's all right, because you've spoken about it. The viewers will understand what you meant. Yeah. And, and then in that moment... Yeah. I've done it again, you know. People like... Well, no one else is questioning it. I've, I've explained it to Huey, you know, but it sounds like he actually understood, because Alice has gone, Huey, come on, you fucking heard him say all this stuff. So, and I'll explain it in the diary. So, do you? You're still here. It would seem like that's another one survived. Uh, fucking what's going on? Only one person. You're going after my people. record at this rate, Jason. You can fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> Huey is talking to Big Brother. Hello, Huey. Hello. How are you this evening? <laughs> I'm just so sarcastic, ain't you? Um, obviously, I'm upset because Ryan went, but I'm literally trying to, to keep it positive and realise that the end obviously is near, whether I get to the final or not, the end is near. And that he had an amazing exit from the house and an amazing time in here. And I'm so happy, I'm so proud of him and I love him by every part of me. Um, but of course I'm sad and upset to keep him going, but I'm to see him going. But I'm literally just trying to stay strong about everything right now. Jason has so dug his grave right now. For me, he's a two-faced prick. He does it in them moments. He's a massive game player. He's a complete and utter fake and fraud. He's a bullshitter. And he's a number one, grade A, 24 carat, 100% liar and fucking twat. That is exactly what Jason is. And I couldn't give a shit about him. I don't want to talk to him. I've told him all that I felt necessary to, that I thought of him. And... I just couldn't give a shit anymore and I really hope he goes home because he deserves it and I know the end is near and um, I hope there's another eviction and I hope it's nominations and I actually, do you know what, I, I actually hope they're face to face so I can tell him all this. I've told him what I've told him earlier, but he can fuck off. Coming up, a surprise package for Alex. Your wildest dreams and everything you want is in this suitcase. Be prepared for offensive language and risky pranks. Twelve nineteen a.m. Laura is talking to Big Brother about being booed by the public. 
If the general public don't like me because of what I've done in the beginning, then I'm sorry to say this because I'm probably going to be even more hated, but fuck you. Seriously, fuck you. Because you are so mean. So mean. But sod it. I know who I am. I know I'm a nice person. And I know I would never do wrong to anybody. Honestly, for whoever thinks that they can judge or have an opinion or what, I just think you try being here. I know my family will be proud. I know my friends are going to be proud and that's all I care about. Fuck, seriously, fuck the people that are booing. I think you're horrible people. Awful. After a few drinks, Evelyn is unpacking. And you just sort of just do that and then whack that in there. Whack that in there. You know what? Just just be a bit creative. Just move your clothing around and you just you just put it in really. Evelyn, shut up. And Thank then you, you guys. Open the <laughs> and then you just put That's it in what there. I'm thinking. Fuck Evelyn. Evelyn. Just put it in there. Just put it in there. You just put more in there. Laura has a question for Alex. Al, I wonder why it is that we haven't bonded. It really surprises me, actually. When I first met you, I thought we'd be one of the ones that, w that would. It hasn't happened. I can't do it. That's we're still right. going to be I'm amazed. Trying to the thing. We're still going to be like... Yeah, of course. There's nothing that each... We've, we haven't done anything to each other. No, not at all. At all. But I, I know that for you... Um, the easy, not the easy target, but the one that makes sense. Yeah, the one that makes sense. I, d I don't get it, but probably just because we haven't. But we out, just of haven't. The, out of I the don't know three why. that were up there, if you think about it, yeah, if it yeah. was different for you, it would be completely mm. different. Like Jane said, if it, it was a different three. It does surprise me, though. It is weird. And then that's how you unpack with Evelyn. Very Bob's, good. Bob's a fucking uncle. Um. Yeah, I mean, that's a nice job, I think, don't you? What do you think? Very. Wacko. Can you zip me up and then, like, give me as a present to Cannon? <laughs> you can help me and say that. To say, just give me a quote, like, your wildest dreams are in this luggage right now. Do you wish to open it or do you wish to not? Right, go on. There's no way you're getting in that. Go, it will fit. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, you're actually gonna fit. <laughs> oh, oh my god! god. Don't, don't pull right, you ready? Right Quick! <laughs> Alex! Don't, don't go over the bump, Jacko. I'm not. Don't go over Your the bump! Your wildest dreams and everything you want is in this suitcase. Do you accept it? We can have so much fun with this. We can have so much fun with this. What should we do? <laughs> <laughs> no, Alex, you can't do this. Well, why? It's a good smudder. Should we just spread all our clothes out? <laughs> No, Sam. Evelyn. No! Shut the fuck up! Sam is amazing! Oh my god, you can't hold it. Well, 43 a.m. Come on. You staying like that? You bring me with you. Oh, did you know it's quarter to one? Is it? Yeah, no wonder I'm tired. I'm sitting here thinking, why am I so fucking tired? Quarter to one, do you? I wouldn't doubt your feet. Yeah. Just one. That's all it. Technique. Oh, oh don't want to ruin the dress. Oh. <laughs> Oh, the threshold. <laughs> <laughs> what do you reckon of this one, Janie? What? What do you reckon of this one? 
she, what one what? She worth keeping or? Oh, I don't know. Is, is she? I don't know. Last time I seen you. Oh, I see. I would think that, yeah, definitely. Do you reckon? Yeah. Yeah, know. I'll buy the hat. I'll buy the hat. Oh, do you want to talk? We can talk. Surprisingly, I... I don't... I, I want to hate you, but I don't. I, I actually probably... <laughs> I want to hate you. Right. But I actually really don't. Right. But honestly, do that to me again. Yeah. And it's going to be a different story. All right, then. You're going to do it to me again, though. You, uh, you, you're going to do it to me again? We'll see. OK. <laughs> you will. Yeah? I know you will. All right. It's fine, though. I've got... It's, I, I don't hate you. I want to hate you. But I really don't. Can't pick Sam. I've been close with him since day. Can't pick Ryan because he's done nothing against yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. I take it into perspective of everything. Mm -hmm. I genuinely thought that the thing that me and you and we'd got out, that was going to be the end of it. But when I'm put in a position and it was only because it was them three that were stood there... Yeah. How can I be wrong? Uh... So you need to listen. No, you need to listen. Oh! Laura! Yeah! yeah! See, family, <laughs> love that shit. Where's my? What does she do? Yeah, oh, you don't even want to know, Hugh dog. Sorry. Fuck's sake. Oh, fuck everyone. Can't be fucking asked. Fucking twats. Literally twats. Jackson, the little shit. Okay. That's all I'm saying. Two or one AM. After tonight's events, Jason is starting to question himself. I'm questioning my, my values. Oh, yeah. I knew I was a bad person. Yeah, three, four, five years ago, I knew I wasn't a very nice person, and I corrected it. Mm. And now I'm questioning myself again: Am I that person again? I fucking done it, doing it again. And I'm just trying, I'm trying to just go over everything in my head. You know, is it me? Is it? Is it something else? Mm. Is it them? But I've got to stop blaming everyone else but myself. Mm. So the only person I can blame now is me. Mm. And I've got it so. So then, right or wrongly, it's my fault. I work everything out tonight and I think about things. I might go into things too much, but um, I'm not as... Sometimes I'm not just as, as thick-skinned as um, I may appear. Mm. Yes, that's deep, isn't it? If only they could tune into Channel 5's Back to the 80s Day tomorrow, it would cheer them right up. Inner Space kicks off at 12.25. Next tonight, exclusive, and for the first time on our shores, it's Bellator Fight Night, Brett from London.